kids' educational games. Hello, I'm Tim. Hi, I'm Melissa, and I live here in Cyprus. We're having a day off from our dancing school, and we're going to have a lot of fun. Unfortunately, a lot of stuff got mixed up. We need to separate the mixtures. Do you know how we can do this? Let's find out together, Melissa. Oh, no. I think a storm has flown most of the stuff into the pool. Do you think you can use filtration technique to clean the pool? Filtration is a method to separate a mixture of insoluble solids from liquids using a net or filter paper. Solids stay behind in the filter and the liquid passes through. Soluble solids cannot be separated this way. They become part of the liquid, like when you put a cube of sugar in tea. Can you help me sort out things that can be separated using filter paper? When mixed with water, could you use a filter to separate these items from the water, or do they dissolve in water? Filter paper. Dissolve in water. Mint leaves. Paint. Flower petals. Shells. Mint leaves. Insoluble. Shells. Insoluble. Flower petals. Insoluble. Paint. Soluble. You're doing great! Pebbles. Salt. Sugar. Apple. Apple. Insoluble. Pebbles. Insoluble. Salt. Soluble. Sugar. Soluble. That's perfect. Peas. Ice cream. Watermelon. Orange juice. Peas, insoluble, ice cream, insoluble, watermelon, insoluble, orange juice, soluble. Excellent! Lemon seeds, tea leaves, glucose, chocolate milk. Lemon seeds. Insoluble. Tea leaves. Insoluble. Glucose. Soluble. Chocolate milk. Soluble. That's perfect. Honey. Flowers. Butter. Cumin seeds. Honey, soluble, flowers, insoluble, butter, insoluble, cumin seeds, insoluble. Well done! Thank you, that makes sense. Today we are planning to have a small party and bake a cake. All the ingredients are here. Can you pick the best method to separate the following mixtures? We can use evaporation, heating the mixture so that liquid evaporates to form steam, leaving the solid behind. Distillation, this is the same as evaporation. 
The only difference is that we collect the vapors of the liquid so we can keep it. Centrifugation. Some ingredients weigh more than others. We can separate the heavier ingredients by centrifugation. To separate salt from salt solution we use evaporation, distillation, centrifugation. Evaporation. Perfect. To separate components of crude oil we use evaporation, distillation, centrifugation. Distillation. Perfect. To separate chalk suspended in water we use evaporation, distillation. Centrifugation. Centrifugation. Perfect. To separate dirt from tap water we use evaporation, distillation, centrifugation. Distillation. Great! To separate butter from milk we use evaporation, distillation, centrifugation. Centrifugation. Great! Thank you for helping me to separate soluble solids from liquids. When using sedimentation and decanting, heavier particles settle down at the bottom of the liquid and liquid can be poured off. Let's see which mixtures can be separated by sedimentation and decanting by deciding if the statements are true or false. Sand can be separated from water by using sedimentation and decanting. True. You're doing great! Gravel can be separated from water by using sedimentation and decanting. True. Perfect! Flower petals can be separated from water by using sedimentation and decanting. Falls. You're doing great! Mud can be separated from water by using sedimentation and decanting. True. That's perfect! Leaflets can be separated from water by using sedimentation and decanting. Fools. You're right! Thanks for your help. We're going to have lunch by the lake. This must be real fun. While we look at the food, let's see what we've learned today. Can you tell me what is the best method to separate the following substances? Please drag the substance to the drop area above the method you should use. Which method should you use to separate meat pieces and gravy? Sedimentation and decanting. Filtration. Evaporation. Centrifugation. Hand picking. Hand picking. Great job! Which method should you use to separate lemon juice and seeds? Filtration. Great job! Which method should you use to separate hard carrot pulp from carrot juice? Centrifugation. You're right! Which method should you use to separate rice and water?
sedimentation and decanting. You're doing great! Which method should you use to separate salt in water? Evaporation. Great! Thank you. I learned a lot about separating mixtures. Congratulations. You have completed the course. <laughs>